Hey guys, it's Roxy with Roxy's Broadway Breakdown. Welcome back to my channel. And today I am doing songs for non-singers. Um, this is for males. I've already done one that included songs for males and females. Um, but I chose uh, male characters for musicals. So, um, if you want to be in musical theater, you're going to have to eventually sing, dance, and act. If you feel like, well, I'm a really good character actor that moves well, or I'm a really strong dancer, um, I can kind of hold, a, you know, carry a tune or, you know, kind of hold my own with a song, but it's not my favorite thing to do. You're just going to have to get over that hump, though, when you go to your singing audition. And the main thing to do is go with your strengths. You know, if you're a dancer, there are some songs that can really show off that you're an entertainer, that you move well. If you're a character actor, there are some songs that really show off like, hey, I've got some real acting ability or comedic timing. So let me give you some options. Let's review the situation, starting with reviewing the situation from Oliver that Fagin does. Now, Fagin is such a scalawag. He's just a rapscallion, and he's so slimy and greedy, and um, he's just a reptilian. And this is such a fun song to get into and, you know, get a character going, and you can show them, wow, they have some real acting ability. They really found this character and they're playing with it. And it's not a song to really sing. It's just a very fast, talky kind of song. So that's why I put this one on the list. From She Loves Me, Tonight at Eight, that George does. Now, this is a very upbeat song. It's fast, but it does have a few notes to hit. So if you feel like, okay, I'm not, you know, a big baritone or a beautiful tenor, um, but I have a little something to my voice, this might be a good song to go with. Um, from Hello Dolly that Vanda Gelder sings, Penny in My Pocket, I like to think of this song as a monologue on pitch. So... You do have to stay on pitch. It's a rather high pitch song. Maybe if you already have a, a high pitch speaking voice. But there's no like big long notes to hold out. But why I like it, because it's a very story telling song and it's a good way to rope them in. And they're gonna be very intrigued and interested in the story. And, you know, that's a good way um, for anybody to be in an audition, you know? Rope them in, intrigue them, entertain them. Um, even the best of singers should do that. Um, all right, from Dirty Rotten Scoundrels, Love Sneaks In that Lawrence does. Now, John Lithgow uh, originated this on Broadway and he's not a singer. So, but it's a pretty ballad, and so sometimes a show will call for that. You know, you need to carry uh, a ballad. You need to sing a ballad in the audition, maybe, and it's just very light. It's not like a big torch song ballad, but it is just a light, pretty song to sing. No big notes, just something light and pretty. All right, um, from Greece, Beauty School Dropout that the angel does. I love this song. I think you could really ham this up if you have great comedic timing. That's what I love about this song. Now, the end does maybe require falsetto. Like if you have that kind of 50s doo-wop falsetto that ooh -wee. Um, if you don't, you can find another way to end it. It's okay. Um, but the whole song is more just kind of talking and that, you know, just very like, hey, you know, you dropped out of high school. Figure something else out, kid. All right, moving along. Um, slide some oil to me from the whiz that the Tin Man does. This is very pop and contemporary, and you can just really play with this and have some fun. It's just a light song to sing. Um, again, it's character. Think character, character, character. All right, from Anything Goes, Be Like the Bluebird that Moonface Martin sings. Moonface Martin is one of the big character reliefs of the show. It's not a fast song. It, it does tend to go rather slow. Again, it's sort of higher toned. Um, so you're gonna have to stay on pitch in a higher tone. Go listen to it. Um, but it's not long, drawn-out notes, so you're just going to have to speak it. And then finally, um, I chose 
uh, very soft shoes from Once Upon a Mattress that the court jester does. And this is really more of a dancer's song. If you're a true dancer, this is a great song because in the show, there's a huge dance interlude that you wouldn't do for an audition, but it is, it lends itself to moving and entertaining and it's very vaudevillian and so it's big personality. And so, you know, if you're thinking, well, I'm really not a strong singer, but boy, can I move and entertain? That might be a great song choice for you. So there you go. There are my choices. If you have some that you like, put them in the comments below. Don't forget to click and subscribe and I'll see you in my next.